We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion, a semi-final encounter here at the Euros, and the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? It's live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to our coverage of the semi-final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me with microphone in hand is Stuart Robson. Excitement levels are off the charts, it must be said. It's Spain versus France. Well, what a match-up between these two excellent teams. Both have played really well to reach this stage of the tournament, but which one is going to go through to the final? I think this could be really close today. Here's the lineup for Spain. Nacho Fernandez plays with Emerick Laporte in central defence. Fabian plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the main stroke. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. And that will be a corner. And played short. The delivery from Dembele. Oh, yeah. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. This to make it 1-0. Goal! Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. Well, here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Rodri. Laporte. Pressing like that will help the cause. This looks more than decent. Oh, that is a superb save. And the ball back with Spain now. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, the threat is there. Played into the box. Oh, a moment of pure class. Unbridled joy for him and the supporters. Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Griezmann. And a fine cross. Oh, a really good header. But the goalkeeper there is a cover-up. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. Played in by Griezmann. Well, not away properly. Griezmann. Now with Mbappe. And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. 
And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. This to give them the lead again. In it goes. Coley converted. Well, here we can see it again. Keeper's gone the wrong way, and it makes for a fairly easy finish in the end. That's how to take a spot kick. Well, 2-1 it is here. Cuts in from the flank. And play halted, free kick given. William Saliba. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Kylian Mbappe. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Good move in the making from France. Griezmann. I'm well, just leaning back a bit and over the bar. Quite possibly a yellow card as their flow was stopped. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Well, I think he'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick. Not the execution he was looking for. Oh, he'll take it on. Got in the way of it. Very quick thinking there. Fabian takes the shot. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, there it is. I'm not sure what all the fuss was about. It wasn't even close in the end. Can someone get on the end of this? And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Another corner. Over it comes. Well, being able to improvise is all part of the game, and it was close. Well, it's a great bit of skill, isn't it? He does everything right apart from hitting the target.
under pressure here. Kylian Mbappe. Spain recovering possession well. Aurelien Chouameni. And Spain struggling to keep the ball. Griezmann. Well, no stopping him. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Good weight on that pass. Went in strongly to win the ball. Mbappe in with a chance. In it goes! It just gets better and better for them. Another goal, and they can truly dream of the final now. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. Morata, Pedri, good looking sequence, but really sticking to the task defensively. Now options are plenty, Morata, a goal, and it's very much game on! Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And that's the perfect strike from Morata. He just hits it with so much control. Three, two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Griezmann. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well, disappointing end to the move. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. That's a good... It has to be! What an astonishing few minutes from seemingly out of it. It's all square again. Can you believe it? Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. Underway again. We can't complain about a lack of entertainment. 3-3. Chouameni. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Really good challenge. Trying his luck. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And over comes the corner. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. 
Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Lovely work to get past his man and his teammate got him out of trouble. Now counter-attacking possibilities here. Must take the lead here. A goal! Well, still a long way to go in this one, but could it be one foot in the final? If the celebrations are anything to go by, the fans believe that's the case. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? A oh, good vision there. And intercepts again. N'Golo Conte. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Now, who can he play it to? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Now, breaking at pace, potential danger. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. France being afforded too much space here. He has time to play it over. Cuts it back. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, let's have another look at this, because he does really well to pick the right pass here. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? And if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. And time for the change now. He has teammates around him. Well, disappointing end to the move. Jose Lu. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up.
And into the last 30 minutes now. Gives it a go. And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, you can't argue with those stats, can you? They've had good chances at both ends. Oh, wait a minute. They could well be in. And it's come off the keeper. And in at the second time of asking. Just what was required. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. And I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Dembele, Aurelien Chouameni, and still trying to get forward Griezmann, over the touchline for what will be a France throw, a foul but advantage played, he could pick out a teammate, Mbappe, and fine goalkeeping. But he's gone short with it. Throw in for France coming up. Dembele with the cross. Managed to get it out of there. Jose Lu. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. 20 minutes remaining. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business, but nothing comes of it. And the counter looks on here, options available. Mbappe, and he's through here. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. Well, for neutrals, this is a joy. 5-5. Five, five. Coman. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. They favoured a short one here. The delivery from Dembele. Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Well, they've decided to make a change.
They take it short. Able to deal with the threat. Might really be able to trouble them here. But timely defending when it mattered. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And that's going to be all for him in this game anyway, Stuart. And if they're not careful, it could be all for the team as well. They're going to be under a lot of pressure now. Well, he might not like the red card, but he's got to calm down here. They're really pressing their opponents. And he saw the situation developing. On the attack, as there to be late excitement. Laporte. Pedri. Now Jose Lu. The ball with Rodri. The supporters want to see him have a go. And a goal! And I'll tell you what, at this late stage, it might truly be final in more ways than one. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Eduardo Camavinga. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. Mbappe. He's in here. It's still alive. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Jose Lu. Well, this is far from over. We're going to have five minutes of stoppage time. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? And it's opening up. Oh, good heavens, miles off target there. Well, I'm not quite sure what he was thinking about there. That's a really poor attempt. Well, there's an example of how to press high up. Mbappe? Oh, what an opportunity! Oh, there it is! And surely we've witnessed the goal that will take them through to the final. Astonishing scenes here!
Nico Williams. Pedri. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation. Attacking. And a goal to get them level. And who will be in the final now? It's anyone's guess. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not over. And two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Well, back on the way here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes. And winning it back. This is looking threatening. A goal! Well, still a long way to go in this one, but could it be one foot in the final? If the celebrations are anything to go by, the fans believe that's the case. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. Mbappe. Mbappe. Now Giroud. And a precise challenge just when it was required. Well, he's certainly not alone. Olivier Giroud at the ready. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. He's in with a chance. And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. Coman. Now Giroud. France really struggling to keep the ball. This attack looks highly promising. And he's in. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Is it going to be Jose Lu? And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Giroud. And support available. Giroud. Giroud. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger.
Now, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Giroud on the move here. Couldn't quite hang on. That's it. Half time in extra time. The second period still to come. Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? And the corner's been given. Whips in by Griezmann and fired against the crossbar. And beyond the last defender, offside. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Giroud, surely! Giroud protecting it. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. And short it is. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. And the referee sees that as a foul, free kick given. Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Pull from the keeper, and they'll come again. Miko Williams. And a strong tackle. Kunde. Now Rabio. And France finding space on the flank. Could be. It's still alive. Nicely timed tackle. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, it is a yellow card and the referee having a word. Well, if they're not careful, they're going to lose a couple more players here. They've completely lost their discipline. They're out of control at the moment. Well, I think it's fair to say he doesn't agree with that decision. Mbappe and Spain regaining possession and good use of advantage the referee allowing play to continue and having a goal oh my goodness what an outrageous hit I can't believe he took it on from there and neither can the goalkeeper
Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw in. And he's hit it with authority! Oh, a magnificent hit from there, and unfortunate to be denied by the woodwork. Well, good technique. He hit it with such power, and you're absolutely right. He's so unlucky. And full time here. Spain have done it. They've climbed the mountain, and they will participate in the final itself here at the European Championship. Well, it was always going to be tight, but they just about had enough energy and quality in that extra time to take them through to the final. Yes, there'll be some tired legs out there, but they won't care about that. What a final we've got in store for us.